breaking news. Former President Donald Trump says that he has been indicted, making him the first former president to be federally charged with a crime. He posted on his social media platform, Truth Social, that the Department of Justice has charged him with mishandling classified documents at Mar-a-Lago. Now, Trump says he's an innocent man and he is being targeted by Biden's Justice Department. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm John Brown. Good evening. I'm Luann Sorrell. Trump is reportedly facing seven criminal counts. And Fox 35 anchor Revieta is live in the Alert Center tonight with more on this. And Ray, Trump is already using this as fuel for his campaign. Indeed, Lou. Just to be clear, the Justice Department has not confirmed these reports. Trump broke the news on Truth Social. About 20 minutes after his post, he kicked off a fundraising with a video. Take a look. Our country is going to hell and they come after Donald Trump, weaponizing the Justice Department, weaponizing the FBI. We can't let this continue to go on because it's ripping our country to shreds. The indictment comes from a months-long investigation. Prosecutors claim Trump took roughly 300 classified documents to Mar-a-Lago after leaving the White House, including some 100 seized by the FBI last August. Trump claims he is being targeted ahead of the next election. This has been going on for seven years. They can't stop because it's election interference at the highest level. There's never been anything like what's happened. I'm an innocent man. I'm an innocent person. They come after me because now we're leading in the polls again by a lot against Biden and against the Republicans by a lot. Trump is also under investigation in Atlanta over trying to interfere with the 2020 election. And this, of course, will be the second indictment for the former president. He's still fighting a 34-count indictment out of New York over alleged hush money payments. He's claimed the district attorney is out to get him. Live in the Alert Center, I'm Ray Vieva. Lou, back to you.